Today is the first day of our basement renovation. This has been something that we wanted to do for like, well I mean we've been in this house for five years and the basement's been unfinished. But um, we actually have a lot of space down here. We have, it's about 1100 square feet. Our laundry room is over there which I will show you because you know. <laughs> so you wanna give everybody kind of a game plan of what this space is going to be. <laughs> Well, I will say this, that it'll be my great joy to give Jessica a great studio. So, I know that I can say this, white is going to be a very um, important thing. It's going to be really bright. We're going to do shiplap everywhere um, and some really cool uh, rustic modern aspects. Like We're going to paint the fireplace, keep it brick. It's gonna be really cool. I'm excited to see. I can see. I can see how things turn out, and so I can just see what this is gonna be like. So these walls are going to be covered, which is why we're kind of letting the kids just go at it with some magic markers right now. Um, and I was over here writing some scriptures on the wall, since it'll be underneath everything here in my studio space. This space will be kind of like my space. Um, a studio essentially but a place to be able to write because I've got several books that I really want to get done but I really think I would do better with a designated space but also we're gonna have like an editing space an indoor place to shoot videos this is gonna be just a really beautiful place and we're gonna have like a seating area and a craft area it's gonna be really cool here's a different look of this room of course we're just sweeping everything up and cleaning it out and there's a sweet Noah he's so cute and then back here is another room. We just uh, just moved everything out of here and swept, and it's so dusty that like we're all sneezing and stuff. But um, this is the bedroom. It's the second room that's off of that studio, which is a really good size room. This, since we've lived here, it has been a bedroom at one point, um, but mostly it's just been storage. And this is gonna be Malia's room which she watches these YouTube videos and I've already told her we're not putting any sneak peeks of the progress of this room until after she gets here for Christmas. I was gonna say, I'm about to tell her what we're doing. Nope, so you guys so. are just gonna have to wait and see what happens in here. Now over here is the other bedroom and this is the most finished room down here. Um, and right now we've gotta finish just taking everything out of here because it's just stripped down to almost nothing. But this is going to be Maya's room, but not really just Maya's, because we're all musical. But this is gonna be our music room. So it's also gonna double as kind of like a, not really a, a theater, but we're gonna put a decent TV down here. And honestly, I like that idea because it's right connected to the studio. So if Jessica's here with just a couple of the kids, she can put on a movie, be close to them, to, you know, saying to keep an eye on them, but also be able to work. And so, and honestly, I just like having, like this room has no natural light, which as a photographer and as a videographer, Jessica hates. As a person who loves watching movies, especially like my favorite, like Star Wars, Marvel, Star Trek, there's no natural light, which means that you're gonna get excellent picture, excellent sound, so it'll be fun. I'm excited about it. Here under the stairs is the Harry Potter closet. It's a bunch of junk. Um, and in here is a bathroom that needs to be just like completely redone. It's not awful. There's me. But we are planning on 
doing that bathroom, um, just like taking that shower insert out, it's really hard to keep clean and it's kind of like stained, it's just old. And tiling that up and then just kind of building some cabinets. This actually is not going to be a terribly expensive remodel. Uh, we are very resourceful when it comes to doing stuff like this. Um, which you've probably learned that if you've been around our channel for very long, like we have our junkyard in the back and we just kind of like get a hold of any free materials that we can. And that's how so much of our farm is put together. But that's actually the plan for our basement too. Over the course of the last year and a half or so, since we really kind of got in our mind what we wanted to do with the space, we have been collecting materials. It does help that Maya's brother has a construction company and so a lot of times at the end of a job he'll have uh, materials that they took out and replaced that are still good. Um, so we ended up with getting like a very large amount of white oak shiplap for free, tile for free, several materials um, that we didn't have to pay for at all. So. We're, we're having to buy some lumber to frame everything up. We're using some pallet woods for some accents and then a lot of those free materials. And then um, we're having to buy some paint some we already had. I've actually been, um, I've got a long list of videos to share with you guys that I've actually even already shot a lot of them. I just have not had much time to edit. And today, I absolutely have not had time to edit because uh, we've been doing this. So. I figured I would shoot a quick vlog kind of showing you guys what we were up to today. Our hope is to get a lot of this done before Christmas. We're not going to touch the bathroom before Christmas because that's going to be a little more time consuming. But as far as the framing, the ceilings, the can lights, um, all of that stuff, we're hoping to get it done. So I'm so excited. It's gonna be really amazing uh, going into January, having this wonderful space where I can pull out my seeds and share it all with you guys. So, thank you for watching. If you have any great ideas that you think would look awesome down in this space, just something really cool or funky or functional that would go with kind of like the whole, you know, farmhousey look that we're gonna go for, go ahead and put a link down below if you got like a Pinterest board or something like that because I am definitely gathering up ideas right now as we embark on this project.